mountains you can find leopards. Leopards are both extraordinarily adaptable. For example, they can carry twice their body weight into a tree to eat their prey, undisturbed by the predators. The Cape leopard is much smaller than its larger cousins in the savannah and could even be considered as a subspecies, which has quite important implications for its survival. Leopards have adapted living mountains to terrain to avoid conflict with humans. They love to eat dices and bookies in this terrain. Leopards are classified as vulnerable by the National Environmental Management Biodiversity Act of 2004, which means the species is facing a high risk of extinction in the wild in the near term. This is mainly due to habit loss, hunting for trade and pest control. But they are losing the battle for survival with less than 300 Cape leopards left in the Cape Fold Mountains. This is due largely to eradication by farmers south of the Orange River. And for example, from 2005 until 2008, as many as 29 leopards were killed in the Cape alone. Fences have no barriers to leopards. Leopards easily jump or climb under fences to so conservation is not easy. This coupled with the long ranges of many up to 100 kilometers means the conflict with farmers and communities is inevitable. Ja, nee, dat is, dat is de eigenlijk niet het probleem, Leipert. Het probleem is die bergen waar hulle loop. Is nie meer, daar is nie meer kost vir hulle nie. Lisa, um, hou verloor, jy, jy kan net jou aantie al volhou, elke jaar, jou, jou oekies aanhou, en um, jy, jy het net te veel verliese. Thank you. 